Let's go. Welcome back to another episode of Dan Geese and Beats of Walking Dead. And where we last left off, we just searched the entire house. And then Kenny, something's wrong with Kenny. And we're going to find out exactly what that is right now. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? Oh, man. I can't get him to come down. Ben. Ben setting us up. Stay here. Creeping. We're actually controlling this right now. Get your gun out, sir. What's going on up here? Kenny? What is he doing? No boats. Kenny, you okay, man? What the heck? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. What the heck? Looks like duck, don't he? Duck hunt. It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Starved. Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. Well, I need the dog food. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. I'll take care of it. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it. Like I did before. Are you sure? We got this. I guess we'll find out. This must have been where he slept. Empty plate, empty water. What a way to live. What a way to die. If you're a walker, you're against us. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until oh, he starved his death. Chest. Oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found the one I did. Bash him. Bash or stomp. Let's bash him. Finish him. I'm sorry. There, he's out of his misery. That's pretty disgusting. We should bury him. I'll take care of it. We can put him in the dog hole? Kenny's getting soft on us. A walker's a walker. I don't know, I just don't have... That means a walker. He either takes you down or... Just kind of gross that he hasn't eaten anything. Put him in the dog hole. What if that thing comes back to life? His eyes just turned on. Did you see that? Put him in the dog grave. What if people get actually emotional during this part? I don't. A boy and his dog, Walter. <laughs> as long as it's not Clem, that's all we're thinking, Lee. And what about the Vagrant? I mean, why are we spending so much time with this kid? We need to go find the Vagrant. Do it, dude. What is the big emotional pull here? 
What's up, Clum? Don't worry, Clum. It's not going to happen to you. What is this? I mean, the, why do we keep looking in the dirt? Are we supposed to be reflecting on life or something? Oh god. going on I thought I saw something outside the fence something or someone didn't get a good enough look the way they move though too fast to be a walker it's dressed in a the suit guy that's wasn't been following it us? the voice on the radio I don't know they didn't say anything just stood there watching creepy as hell creepy McGee here comes Kenny's roasters Kenny I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's on his shoulders? Lee thinks he might have seen someone out there spying on us. Maybe it's a goddamn bell ringer. Man, remember when walkers were what we were most afraid of? Those are starting to seem like the good old days. Thanks, Ben. Well, the hell with this. I'm not gonna let whoever's out there keep us from getting our boat. We've holed up here long enough. I'm heading down to River Street. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready. Or I'm going down leg. to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well, then hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No, Ben, you'll only slow us <laughs> down. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. Ben, you're you alive. stay ability. behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. We need to focus on finding a boat right now, Clem. Like we talked about on the train, remember? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear Sorry, and we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. They have guns, right? Gotta keep her safe, sir. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Yep. Yes, we are. Stay and protect That's Clementine. That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. We're not talking about walkers, sir. Anything or anyone. Good. Trusted Ben to look after Clementine. That's a scary thing. Scary, scary. That guy can't protect himself. I don't know why he's, why is he so weak sauce. He's just so weak sauce. He had a chance, and he continues to be more and more weak sauce. It is we're at East Bay and Lincoln Street. I wonder if that's a shout out to. The, Andrew Lincoln, who plays Rick in the series. What is that? What are you doing, Kenny? He's just focused on a boat. Look at him. When things get quiet, that means there's trouble around the corner. Keep an eye out for Chuck, Keep sir. Keep eye out for Chuck. He might be waiting for us around here. Yeah, sure. 
Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Let them do their thing, sir. What in the hell is going on? Maybe it's a way they can navigate the city. Maybe whoever's ringing that is just trying to distract us, create a diversion. That diversion, Whatever, man. sir. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. Keep moving. Let's keep moving, sir. Get your gun out, Lee. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're. Oh my god. The boats. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new Got plan. Got no boats, man. This is the plan, Lee. This is our best and only shot. You said so yourself back at the house. You agreed with me. Yeah, but that was before we... He's freaking out. Kenneth. We can't fix that, sir. This one might still be salvageable. Sorry. Kenny, get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh, yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Tell you what, if I ever need an expert opinion on American history or on committing murders, I'll be sure to ask. But how about you leave the nautical shit to me? I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. Handlebar mustaches. To. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Kenny's life just came shattering down. <laughs> and when we return with the next episode of Dan Geesing Beats The Walking Dead. We're going to take a look at that telescope and uh, maybe deliver some more hard, real truth to Kenny. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you can let me know by hitting the like button below and also by subscribing to the channel to be notified the next time a new video comes out. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you next time. Later.